season in the air, but the rain fall. This a motherfucker when I hate. What is good y'all, this is JV here and today I got a reaction for you guys. Today we're doing uh, Last Orca's part 5. Uh, we have Keith Ape, uh, K Supreme and Occasion with the song Fendi. Excited to check this out. Literally every time this is new Last Orca's I'm like, I don't know how long this is going to go. And it looks like there's no end in sight because we keep getting new releases or at least new uh, visuals. But I'm excited to check it out. Uh, again, I'm down to support the movement no matter what, even though it's not necessarily my cup of tea musically. Uh, but I'm hoping, you know, I've definitely enjoyed a lot of Keith Ape tracks in the past, you know, dating back to his Kid Ash material. Uh, so I'm excited to see what he, he does uh, in this time. And again, quick shout out to 88 Rising. Uh, so let's not waste no more time. Let's get straight into it. Again, we have Keith Ape with Fendi. Let's go. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Hoping for a banger right here. They ain't playing around with this series though. We five in right now. For the longest I spelled Keith they wrong. I put the I before the E. Same thing with like Chief Keith I would misspell constantly. Hey. Oh, this is some, this is some Renzo type shit. My, yo, my guy would love this shit. Some of this like ignorant trap rap though be too much for your boy, you know? <laughs> I like his flow though. It's those lazy deliveries though, I, I can't do it. The display onto the sweater though, that, that doesn't fly. Hey. I don't know about this instrumental, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Man, Keith A de definitely is doubling down on this like ignorant ass sound that has worked for him. So in that regard, I'm all for it. But that flow is the, definitely the redeeming feature for this though, because I'm not really feeling the overall delivery, like the energy wise. I'm not really feeling instrumental, but. In the fact that, uh, 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 I can't, I can't do it. But I know a lot of people rock with that kind of sound, so. I don't understand them at all. But I, I get what they're definitely going for. Uh, let's see what occasion you got. The uh, yo, and people are loving that ad lib nowadays. You got like Uzi doing it. There's people in the the sailing team over on Yachty. People are loving that. Oh, you see some of the awful record guys do it too. And this definitely kind of falls in that kind of sphere of music. I'm sure, there's a lot of uh, overlap in terms of audiences there. But I'm sure in like an avenue like where they're bumping on some speakers and like people like vi like just going nuts at a concert, I can see why this, you know, could like slap for sure. Me alone, you know, with some headphones is probably not going to cut it, but I could see this kind of in the concert or festival or, you know, maybe in, even in a car, just crank that up. I could see, you know, the appeal to a song like this. When the, the drums kick it, again, like, if there was more pronounced percussion on this, I, I feel like I would like it a little bit more. It's just the instrumental combined with the vocal delivery from the MCs is just coming off super, like, empty. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. And I, I could already see it now. People are gonna be like, oh my god, he has a different opinion than me. Dislike, dislike, whatever. I'm gonna say, this is definitely probably my least favorite song of, of the Last Orca series. Because I rock with Keith Ape, and I rock with Occasion. I feel like I've heard some K-Supreme stuff uh, on SoundCloud before. But yeah, nah, I wasn't feeling this track. But again, if this is your cup of tea, more power to you. I do 
you know, mess with these guys. But this particular song, nah, it's not for me. Uh, curious as to what y'all thought about it. So in the comment section below, let me know what you thought about the song and the music video. Till next time, this is JV. I love you guys. Bye.